It's your boy James, but to stop being dirty, stop eating dirty. It is 3.26 a.m. I couldn't sleep. I was just laying there, tossing and turning, not picking up my phone, doing the routines that I personally do, I bet many others do, so that I can make sure to keep that tired feeling, you know what I mean? Go take a piss with the lights off and peel on the floor and like, you know, not look at your phone and get distracted by Cardi B's. Okay, so anyway, uh, you know, so I decided, you know what, let me get out and start my day early and hit some cardio. And um, that doesn't really have to apply with the message I'm trying to give you today, but it does apply when I when, when, with the message of saying, you know, utilize your time in life. You know, let's not just let it pass by in front of us. Let's not let the day get ahead of us and say, oh, I could have did this and I could have did that. You know, my day doesn't have to start till 6 a.m., but I'm up way before that getting the work done that I might not be able to get done later on. Though it was due to me not being able to fall asleep, but a lot of times in my past life, I would go to the kitchen, eat something to kind of, you know, satisfy my stomach and that helped me fall asleep like a little fat turd so instead of doing that i'm here working now i want to talk to you about plateauing and um really with weight loss plateauing and this could apply to like many plateaus physically as far as you know muscle gain you know you start you know you get those newbie gains and that's when you really first start going to the gym you when you're overweight the weight flies off shit i remember when i was 253 pounds you know i'm telling you i think i lost 20 pounds in less than a month. It's because the body doesn't want to hold that much weight. You're so overweight, the body's like, oh my God, like get this off of me. So when you start putting the effort between diet and physically working out, the weight flies off. But then you come to a point where we all been, damn, I've been lifting these weights for this long. I feel like my muscles aren't getting bigger. Damn, I'm dieting, cardio, and doing this and that in the gym, and I haven't lost any weight. Like, it's my, I weighed in on Monday, and I lost freaking half a pound in two weeks. Listen, the answer to that is work harder than last time. Mental, mental note the fact that you work harder than last time. We don't even mental note it. We're living in a world where we have phones. Go on your phone, go on the notes and write. Like today, for example, I'll say, okay, I did the elliptical for one hour. In that one hour, I was managed to do six miles, but this is the level I did it on, seven, a steady seven. So now the next time I do it, I'll do it for one hour again, but the difference is I'll do it on level 10. Now that's a big jump. So, so you know, you know for, for someone who doesn't go to the gym as much, go to level eight, then level nine, and make sure you work harder than last time. If you did three sets last time, of 10 reps, do four sets next time of 12 reps. Change the body, shock the muscle. The body's very smart. It's very smart. He knows, oh, here's Jim's. He's out to do the treadmill for 30 minutes. Then he's gonna do elliptical for 30 minutes. Let me guess, he's gonna go do the bench press after that. Then he's gonna do... The body's smart. Once it gets used to it, it becomes a routine. And once your body realizes you're in a routine, it's gonna stop losing weight, it's gonna shut down on you, but work harder than last time. If you're consuming 2,500 calories, and that's what you were doing to lose all the weight, start consuming 2,300 calories. Be mindful of your calorie intake, the calorie maintenance, calorie surplus. Surplus, gain weight, maintenance, stay the same. Uh, um, a deficit is losing. Be aware of all these things and work harder than last time. Simple answer. If you hit the plateau, increase the workload in which you're working out with the weights, with the reps, with the sets, with the cardio, with the level, with the time, with your diet. And I promise you, you will see the gains. Muscle growth, weight loss, and whatever your goal is. Work harder than last time. Stop eating dirty. Link in the bio for the merchandise. I just wanted to spread that message today to y'all. Let me get back to this cardio. Hope you're all being blessed out there and enjoying your, I think today's Wednesday morning. Uh, seems like the world is getting little by little more open. You know, with the corona and all this wild things going on. Hopefully our families and friends could be more, we can start being more social again, start going places again. And for God's sake, seeing women, everyone just look like a dirty nurse walking around. You can't go to no bars no more. You can't do anything. But I hope you're making the best of it, man. Stay blessed. Protect your peace. Trust the process.